hey it's working anyway what's going on everybody hopefully you all are having a wonderful wonderful day we're on episode 109 of saga lock which is actually freaking insane um i really can't fathom that we're already here in saga lock like it doesn't feel oh my god i'm gonna sneeze it does not feel like we're here already <laughs> okay i hate when you have to sneeze and then it's just like oh by the way actually like you you have to sneeze but it's gonna be caught right in your nose for like ever blah um can we not and say we did like no stop like ugh. anyways hopefully i'll have a wonderful day sorry that caught me off guard obviously um and yeah we're out here um we're our goal is to take on the pastoria city gym leader so we're gonna actually have another gym leader back to back which is splendid wonderful amazing and all of the above because honestly we do need one of those we need a fun successful gym episode um we had one actually last episode which is spectacular but also it nerve-wracking in its own right so yeah hopefully we don't have to be nerve-wracked uh this episode while we're on about 213 i believe we get a solid encounter if i can kind of do it right um Oh my god, I walked right into that. I have a habit of just walking right into trainers that I... Oh, I didn't heal. Crap. Uh, but yeah, I really do have a horrific habit of just walking straight into the trainer that I need to, like, not. <laughs> and it makes me laugh because I'm like, oh, you know this trainer that was just literally sitting here, like, not moving at all that you ran into? Yeah, that girl. I was like, oopsies. Yeah, I walked directly into that, which is, like I said, hilarious. Um... Is this same route or is this different route? Um, I'm not 100% sure. Oh, girl. No. Oh, my gosh. Girl, stop. Stop. Don't look at me. Thank you. You can rock smash it. Yes, we can. Heart swap. That's terrible. Sorry. That's like a horrific ability thing. Is this a new route or is this? No, it is not. So this is route 213 as well. I have Papa Berries and Ross Berries. And then I, what is this berry right here? Like, I see it. Agwav. I don't know. Agua berries seem cool, though. Like, they seem like a fun plant there to just have and be a part of. Bum, bum. Ooh, uh, it's a slack off. I will take it. I will definitely take it. It has Dizzy Punch already and Whirlwind. Ugh. No, 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 no. Wait. Oh, my God. You have Whirlwind. Uh, it could be Razor Wind, though. So, like, I'm going to hope it's Razor Wind. We caught it anyway. We didn't have to worry about it. Uh, yeah. Yeah. We didn't have to worry about if it was Whirlwind or Razorwind. Well, actually, no. Whirlwind would have been immediately. Actually, now that I think about it, it was definitely Razorwind. I'm going to name it Cindy. Cindy the Slackoth. I like that name a lot, actually, for a Slackoth. Cindy. Cindy be good. Um, hopefully, Cindy has a good ability as well. So that way we can play off of the fun ability that Cindy may or may not get. So, again, if you're enjoying Sog Luck, let me know by hitting the like button below. Um, I honestly am having such a good day um i had a nap today and this nap was like the most glorious nap in the world it legitimately like i don't i, I was gonna say saved my life but a nap really can't save your life it saved my day though because i only had three hours of sleep originally and i was just like oh like i had a headache and everything and it was bad it was like i was trying not to have this headache and this headache was bothering me but we did get it fixed. We got it alleviated, and like I said, we feel a bunch better, which is just all, always positive when you can feel better. And I'm just, I'm just happy and proud that I get to be here, hang out with you guys, and just have a genuinely fun time. Um, but I have a couple questions of the day for you. So, what is some of your top pet peeves? Um, and let me know what they are, because honestly, I love knowing pet peeves. One, so I can avoid them. And two, so I can use them to my advantage. Uh, <laughs> exactly. Um, so, some of, of my big ones is being blamed for stoop that I didn't do. Um, or didn't have any root cause in. Oh my god. That, like, oh, that sets me off like a firecracker. Like, my jeebies like if I, if I get set off like if there's the number uh, like a number one thing I get set off by it's by like 
being not being told that I like being told that I'm the issue when clearly it's either I'm not the issue or the issue is mutual. Like, because I am a god at accepting my faults. Like, if I did something wrong, I'm going to tell you I did something wrong. Like, that's just who I am. That's what I do. Um, so, it's like, like, again, if, if, let's, let's say that I broke something. I broke, like, a wheelchair, I guess. And people are like, oh, did you break the wheelchair? Yeah, I broke the wheelchair. That's my fault. It's my bad. Do you want me to pay for it? Do you want me to do X, Y, Z? Um, or you didn't coordinate this for the project. Um, is there anything that you can do to help improve the project or make it better for all of us? Because um, you need to make up the fact that you didn't do X. Yeah, let's figure it out. Let's get it taken care of. Um, but when I am told about being an issue or if like there is a problem that w either one I don't know how to solve and I voiced or two um that I just am being blamed for for the sake of being a target oh Nelly it's a problem and yeah like I don't snap that is something that doesn't happen very often Except for episode 101, but that's a different story. That's called First Week of the Month, John. And, like, that was a bad First Week of the Month, John. That was, like, probably the worst First Week of the Month, John, that I've ever had. Um, so, again, that, that that does elicit a different kind of story. Again, there's no excuses. Like, was I pissed off, angry, and mad and probably shouldn't have posted that episode? 100%. But did I? Yes, because I wanted to I focus on being on time. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, okay. But, yeah, so should I have done that? No. Did I? Yes. Um, but again, admitting my fault, I probably should have just, you know, like, recorded an episode later knowing that it was an oofy episode. Um, but yeah, like, if I'm just being targeted, oh my god, it's a colossal mess, and you don't want to be around when that happens because oh like i said it's bad it's really bad when that situation is present or in the forefront <clears throat> we have a wiki berry okay i have one do i have raspberries i do okay i've got three raspberries and a wiki berry do i rem i don't even remember where i like grew my original patch of stuff <laughs> oh my god where did i where did i do that i guess i gotta go find them and see what's going on with them like if they actually are growing like does speed up actually make them grow or do they actually go based off of the real time clock i'm curious and i wonder if you guys know the answer because if you do then because yeah like i said i'm trying like I think I get, like, a couple of berries every time I plant them. I don't think you can just get one. Because if you just get one, that's kind of just dumb, in my opinion. Just to get, like, a singular... It's like, oh, yeah, you just get this singular one thing that you may or may not need. And it's just like, but, but, but game. Like, why, though? And it's like, what can I do to <laughs> fix that? Because that's a problem. Um, okay, everybody's leveled up. Okay, cool. So I'm going to go ahead and get my Pastoria City encounter, then. And hopefully it's good. I need. I kind of need this to be a good encounter for us. But yeah, no. I like I said. I am terrible at just like being. I am not a person to be a, the forefront of an issue. Like fun in games is fine. Oh, cool. We actually wait. We caught a regular Nidoran too. Oh no, that was our token. That's right. But yeah, like, ooh. Like, um, actually, I can talk about it. I kind of, I was talking to Joy a little bit. And I, I really shouldn't have taken issue with the thing at hand. Um, which actually concerned this series. And it was about 
like me intentionally sacking something because well one the episode prior i literally talked about not doing that uh, because that's just to me it's dumb to do that uh intentionally sacking is not a strategy that i like to employ personally if people employ it people employ it and that's just again not something that i have control over not something that i um i can't control every pokesuber in the world and be like nope can't do this this is not allowed um but i guess what upset me was the fact that it was just like oh you know this trust thing that you know i've been spending nine years building up yeah we don't trust you at all about this and it's just like i just talked about legitimately how i don't do that and it's being called into question and I guess the part of the reason I took issue with it was because it's like y'all should know by now that I don't like I've not intentionally done that if I like and why would I start with clickbait like yeah would it build a story kind of and I know we were talking about building stories and doing that but I don't want to intentionally sack and end their story like I'm not gonna write a season two of Sogalog. There is no season two. Sogalog is Sogalog. That is what it is. And it will be what it is. Like, I can't just be like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Then we're going to have a season two of Sogalog. Let's do it again. Because it's just like Monthlog. You really can't repeat a Monthlog. Because it is a one-time journey. So why would I soil it in making it not genuine? Because if I made it not genuine, like, trust, loyalty, and honesty are three massive pillars in my life and if you don't have like i i become wary very quickly um when those pillars aren't being met to my standards which are high because i'm a scorpio sorry like i have high standards um and uh emotional intelligence is important so when like why would i intentionally break a pillar of mine in order to create better content like why would i destroy myself to be popular that's not that's not who i am that's not who i really am going to be like ever because i would feel disgusted in myself and if i'm feeling disgusted but i'm famous does that make me a better person absolutely freaking lutely not like no that's not gonna happen it's not gonna make me better it's actually gonna make me a worse person um so yeah, I took a little bit of an issue. Um, and I'm addressing it in Sogloc a couple episodes later because I didn't... I wanted to make sure I didn't have as much of an emotional screamo. Um, and I wanted to be more um, interactive and, like, just show you guys my point of view on this situation. Like, memes, fun, and games, that's, that's something. It's gonna happen. It's Sogloc and it's, like, stupid things happen. Like... You know, preschoolers can have kids, and we punt children. Like, things like that happen, and those are fun. And those are things that... <laughs> I love that they're recurring memes. Like, they're things that I've said. They're things that, like... If they've happened, they're in the past. Um, Pokemon are a meme. Daddy the Machamp. Like, po Pokemon are a meme at this point. Be Barry. Like... Uh, channel references are going to happen, especially along a nine-year career uh, in this. Um, and I can, it's weird to actually be able to call it a career because actually they like make money doing it. Um, it's very odd to call it a career, but in this profession, things are going to happen like that. But calling into question whether like my trust and my loyalty and my love for this series and for you guys pissed me off. Um, like, to the point, I was talking to Joy about it, to the point, I was literally going to calc every single Pokemon and make a community post being like, guys, any Pokemon died to a crit psychic. It just happened to be that the crit psychic was on B, or uh, not on B, sorry, we talked about B and B's love and B's life. Um, it happened to be on clickbait, and... If it would have happened to anybody, it, it would have completely, like, a singular psychic probably murdered Roll at that state that he was in. And a crit psychic definitely murdered Roll. And, like, 
Also, I was going to count check that I lived at Dragon Breath plus Dragon Claw because I did. There was a chance it was not 100%. I don't think. Uh, I'm going to be 100% genuine and honest. I do not think it was 100% chance to live, but I think I had like a 70% chance at least. There was still a majority percent chance that I'm living that, and that's why I stayed in. Um, and actually, we did see that roll happen um, before because I went from 55 all the way down to 6, so I definitely lived, and we proved that theory, and then it psychic crit me. So, again, I... It's hard because it's one of those, like, I'm trying to teeter this line, right? And this line is, well, there's fun in games. There's jokes and memes and stuff like that. But, and, like, if you would have, like, laughed about the fact that, like, Clickbait died to a psychic, they're just like, oh my god, John. And just, like, you, of course you killed that. Like, Joy's comment. Joy's comment was perfect. It was, like, a lot of, like, a lot of things in there. And then it's like about like you know what i was talking about in the video and all that stuff and then then she goes of freaking course the first mon to die to your hands is clickbait that was funny because yeah like what the heck game like and what the heck song luck and everything of course the first one's gonna be that mon and it's gonna draw a lot of attention and it's gonna draw some honestly um some unfortunate issues that I didn't want to deal with and I'm confronting because I'm in a good mood and actually have self-confidence today Woo! um also we're gonna take forever to freaking fight these Krogon so we're not gonna actually get to freaking our objective today yay so much fun it's actually ridiculous um so I was totally happy go lucky until the question of my legitimacy and my trust and my loyalty was in question that is what set me off to no end and like i guess it's a positive thing that i'm recognizing what set me off as well because i'm trying to learn myself and trying to learn what sets me off what makes me mad like and i guess not really learning what and like i guess I'm trying to phrase it. It's not learning what makes me mad because it's accepting. There we go. It's accepting what makes me mad and what makes me upset and trying to alleviate and rectify. Because, like, I had a situation today where I just said, screw it. I Like, I talked about it at work. Or I talked about it not at work. I talked about the work situation last episode. I said, screw it. Let me take the reins. I don't care that, like, it's not 100% my responsibilities and my duties. I have no freaking care in the world. I'm taking the reins. I'm doing it. I'm taking control. Because I know that it's actually making me upset that it's not getting done. Because hard work and being able to, like I said, be trustful, loyal to my... And that was really my loyalty standpoint coming into play. Because I wanted to be loyal to the other associates and make sure that they got their stuff taken care of and that they were taken care of. Did I care about myself? Not really, like, honestly, like, to be fair. I, I'm bad at that. Um, where I'm like, I don't care about myself. And, like, this is finally... I'm building up the courage to be like, y'all, like, my legitimacy being in question is a no-no. Because, like, that was so blah. Um, that I had to spend a long time belonging to Joy about it. And I'm so thankful that Joy listens and, like, is there and that, you know, we both can, like, be mutually amazing with each other, to each other. I don't know. I don't know how to phrase it to make it sound okay. But, like, we're just there. We're there for each other. At, 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 like, literally all costs. I'm naming, why did I name this John? What the frick? Um, it's a male. <sighs> I'm going to name it Dakon. I miss Dakon and hope Dakon has a wonderful day. Okay. Um, so, yeah. It's like it's annoying that, again, legitimacy got called into question. Because, again, if that didn't happen, I was totally fine. And I was, like, set to have a great day. And I knew that this, I knew the episode would cause an issue. And I guess 
that also is hard too when you know that there's gonna be a problem and you want to avoid that being a problem but you know it's going to and it's just like i how do i fix it what do i do to make it better and not knowing what to do to make it better is hard it does like i said it creates it creates a stress that i don't like having created and being a part of i'm gonna just sneak behind you Ew, uh, stop giving me trash champs, please, game. I would appreciate that. This is where I got wall rain, so maybe I get something good here. Ha <laughs> ha! It's a Charizard! Oh my gosh, wait! I got Sammy and Mega in this patch of grass. This patch of grass is amazing, okay? Like, oh my gosh, yo! Oh my god, it's a download Mega! Oh! Uh, okay! We we chill. We out here. Download Mega. Let's go. Okay, this is awesome. Okay, I'm very happy with this. Uh, it has Air Slash already. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, something's. I mean, especially when something's literally about to die. This is like yes moment. Although I do have Babe. Uh, and Babe's gonna be probably on the team. Oh, you got Roost too. Let's go. Let's go. I'm super excited. Okay. Um. This is enlightening, I guess, is what I'll, the words and the verbiage that I'll use. Don't crit. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're, we're chill. We're chill. We're chill. Oh, frick. Okay. You have a recoil move. I gotta be careful now that I know you have a recoil move to not let you die. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna try and get you. Oh, frick. No. I want the Charizard. Give me the Charizard. Thank you. I want the download, Mega. I'm, like, extremely excited. Let's go. We got Dacon and Mega today. And we got a fully evolved Mega. We don't get a fully evolved. I think this is the first time since Mega's been on the channel that we've had a fully evolved freaking Mega. Yes! Uh, I'm, I'm too hyped. I'm too hyped over that. But, like, who wouldn't be hyped? It's a fully evolved Mega, and Mega supported the channel forever. Since 2017, Mega has been here on the channel. So the fact that I finally finally have an actual charizard um i did actually have a charizard in uh in uh another series it was the pokemon sun my one of my uh, original pokemon sun but i think that was pre-mega oh that series is that old no way there's no way that series is that old no i refuse used to believe that that series is actually that old hello i gotta see if that series is actually that old oh my god i feel that that's disgusting that that series is that old i i there's no way it's pre-mega right like there's no way that series is four years old no way right God, I feel old. Anyway, on that great feeling old note, we're going to send you guys off uh, with a wonderful day. And honestly, hopefully your Sunday has been fantastic. I, like I said, I love you guys. And I hope you guys enjoy this every single day. Um, I'm going to go ahead and while uh, I do the outro, I'm going to check my box, see how the other two Pokemon are doing. But yeah, no, like I said, I love you guys a ton. And honestly... Being able to just do this for nine years is just been, it's uh, not nine years, it's almost nine years, has been just a splendid experience that I just enjoyed. Ooh, bad. Okay, we know you have download. Roost and Dream Eater, okay. Like, it's just been a splendid experience to just be able to do this and, like, be a part of this with you. So, again, I love every single one of you guys and i know today was a little bit more of a ranty episode but i kind of needed that um considering the blahs the time of the blahs um but we're gonna take on the pastoria gym in the next episode i am sorry about how slow this is progressing um i kind of feel like i'm progressing a lot slower than i have been in recent past um and yeah so Next episode will be on the channel on Tuesday. It'll be a kill episode, so make sure you guys are there for that. And 
the eventual goodbye to a Pokemon I know is dying. So, I love you all. Keep up the amazing work that you do every single day. Make sure you subscribe if you're new, um, as episodes of the series go out most Sundays, Tuesdays, and Fridays. Um, if I do miss a day, uh, you'll be updated in the Discord a lot of the time. Or if I know I'm going to work on it and post it the next day, you'll see it the next day if you're not updated. Uh, but yeah, I love you. I miss every single one of you. And I hope to be able to communicate and talk to you guys in the Discord. Bye.